There's a lot you can learn yeah. when there's not much left. We're in for a ride. A ride we're not sure we asked for, but we'll take it anyway. <laughs> Robin Buent is finding out losing a home isn't the worst thing that can happen. But at the end of the day, I'm just glad my kids are okay and, and, and all of that. Even still, seeing what's left of her home after yesterday's fire isn't easy. Inside is a total loss. At one point, you just got to just get up and put one foot in front of the other. It's a good thing she lives in North Ogden. And over, overwhelmed and appreciative is, is all I can all I can say. And I wish there was better things than thank you. Neighbor after neighbor stopped by to not only make sure she was OK, <laughs> but to drop off cash, food, Ooh, that smells good. And to ask how they could help. I'm going to be staying with my oldest. She just lives up the street. One neighbor organized donations on her Facebook page. It took off. Luckily, their Christmas is taken care of, but it's the needs that are going to come long term. They're good on toilet paper, probably for the rest of their lives, but the cash or even gift cards for the kids to do fun things to get their minds off of everything that's going on. And get this, the family only moved to North Ogden a year and a half ago. That doesn't matter. We're all here together as a family. Turns out Robin and her kids had this big family. <laughs> Take care. Thank you. They never even knew. It just means it just means a lot. Like I just people I've never even met coming up and saying a prayer and giving us money and just wishing us well. Robin says she would like to rebuild here in this very same spot, but even if she can't, she says she wants to stay in North Ogden. She knew it was a good community before, but now she says she really knows. I mean, it makes, makes me feel good that people want to do that, but then I just, I know there's people out there that are worse off than I am. And that's what residents say North Ogden is all about. Always thinking of others, no matter what. I just, I don't know, and I'm just hoping one day I can repay the favor. In North Ogden, Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News.